Searching around, trying to find my way and where we need to be at. I love you too, babe. How you doing?
<laughs> hey, what's up, bruh? Grinning face with smiling eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, he off his shot. Dumbass.
go up here real quick. I want to inspect and see what's going on. Dang, I can't fire them right now.
the bodies hit the floor.
Totally agree. If the graphics, graphics is so good, can you actually see how flat Ellie's chest is? <laughs> hell yeah, I definitely can agree, bruh. Yo. <laughs> hey, yo. She do look bony as hell, though, man. <laughs> oh man, that was funny. See what's in here, man. I think this is where all the prisoners be at. See corpses hanged up.
Damn. She looks sunburnt and all that shit. like a slow ass snail girl come on Oh, my God. 
Shorty, nice. Dang it, a bit strong. Damn. Should have beat the fuck out of Joe. Looks deserted. They should, they should join forces since both of them are going to be hunted by the wolves. I can agree. I can agree. Both of them got got even with each other. A lot of their family members got killed. A lot of their friends got killed. They should just call it even. They should just squash the beat. Plus, both of them had opportunities to kill each other, you feel me? Hello. Honey. What's up? I have a problem. 
Yeah. Well, I just got, we all just got a group text message from the daytime supervisor. And yeah. And he apparently got a, he apparently got a phone call from the big boss. Because Josie's not here. So mm -hmm. we don't have no supervisor right now. And somehow the big boss found out they're given out the vaccination here in the cafeteria. Mm -hmm. So there was a group message sent out letting everybody know that if you don't get vaccinated, you cannot work. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah, so what do I do? I mean, the people are here. I mean, do I risk it and do it? I can keep my job. Yeah. Or do I say, or do I say that how would it is just be looking for another job? Do you want to say that? Because, you know, I'm afraid to do this because of my business. That's my only fear right now. Wow, that's crazy. Like, that's like, yeah, like literally, I still have the text message in my phone. And, and it reads as follows. I mean, that's why I said I have to talk to you because you know, I'm not going to do this decision without you. This reads as follows. It says, hey, the boss called me and he said that the cafeteria is doing the vaccine. Who doesn't have it because whoever whoever doesn't have it won't be able to work without being vaccinated. So basically, they're forcing you to do stuff. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, we already had this discussion about that. Well, I mean, how are you on? Are you taking your medication? I mean, I'm taking the vitamins and stuff every day. All right, that, that should be able to fight it then. Do what you gotta do. You sure? Yep. All right, because you know I'm not gonna do this without asking you first. That's why I said I had a situation I need to talk to you about first. Yeah, I know they're gonna make you take because, the other one. Because the one, the one they're doing here is Pfizer, and it's a, and it's a two dose. Yeah, I know they're gonna make you take both of them. I know. Yeah, the first one is here today, and then the second one is also here on July the first. I know. Take it. You're gonna end up getting sick though, but take it. All right, man. All right, man. I love you. Love you too. Alright, babe. I had set under control. And you need to stop harassing Jesse about my patrols. She, that was just one kiss. That was just one kiss. I don't know why she did that. I do like her. I have no idea what that girl intends to do. I do, I do know she, 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 she looked lucky to have you. You're such an asshole. It'd have been nice if Joel would have played in this game, at least played, played, played in it before they killed him. Instead of just being on the storyline. But you took that from me. me. I would, I would do it all, all over again. again.
just, just. I think I can never forgive you for that. I, I, I beg to try. Well, at least they squashed the beef. means to save your, your your ungrateful ass, shorty. He cared about your simple ass. That's why he did it. At least he apologized to you for lying. from the first game they followed through from the first storyline on the game the only difference is the the bow and arrow the bow and arrow is a lot better than the first one the first bow and arrow on the, on the game the first game that shit was off. I mean it was weak I mean it didn't have no explosives it really didn't have nothing I mean, the first one had the, the AR. They should at least had the AR on the second one. Now, on the first storyline was just on point, totally on point. I wouldn't mind them re-enhancing that one to make it see the difference between the first one and the second one. But the first game was just off the hook. I didn't like the game at first until I started playing. But as time went on, the game grew on me. I liked the first one. The second one, I mean, it was just too much gay shit. I mean, like, damn near everybody was damn near gay on this on this game. I mean, the violence was off the hook. The storyline was just really all over the place. I mean, it backtracked from the first game to, to when they were young. It just kept flashbacking too much. And plus, when when you like really getting into the game, and then it it takes that, that adrenaline away with these dragged out storylines. The storylines was like really dragged out, but the action was beautiful, especially the graphics. When you blow their heads off or the melees and stuff like that, that that what draws anybody into the game if you're into a venture game. 
overall, from a scale of one to ten, I would give it at least about a nine seven five. Other than they lose points on on a homosexuality and going back and forth with the storylines from their childhood, getting you increased with the game and all psyched up, and then they take that energy away. That that to some people that's a turn off. That's just a a lot of energy just being wasted. It can get boring at times. It gets dragged out. But to me personally, I think it's a great game. Other than all the little minor defects, it's damn near a perfect game. I mean, personally, I think they should continue on with the saga, honestly. That's just my personal opinion. I think she should meet up with Abby again. They can sit down and talk this this little beef out and just squash it and look at the bigger picture. Like they're being hunted right now. This is the bottom line and the main beef is like these monsters. The monsters and the people that's not with with them what they trying to do. You feel me? That's my intake on the game. So I'm signing out. See y'all the next go around. Y'all be safe. Later.